it was fire on the web. Of course, not really, because that would be bad for all servers. As a symbol, though, the flames roared with a fury that hadn't been seen since the 2011 Great Cat Filter. Who did it? Taylor Swift had done it again. She is the queen of catchy songs and hidden messages. This time, though, it wasn't a cleverly hidden reference in a new song or an Instagram post that was timed just right. Instead, this was a brave, all-out attack on the hearts of the internet, a move that could only be called, surprising. It all began at the Met Gala. The biggest night in fashion, which is usually a blur of couture dresses and strange outfits, was overshadowed by Taylor's one simple accessory. A custom-made charm bracelet with each charm a small silver ode to her boyfriend, NFL star Travis Kelsey. A little football, a little red Kansas City Chiefs cap, and a charm in the shape of his number, 87, were there. But the real showstopper was a tiny lightning bolt, which was a nod to his exciting field nickname, the Kelsey Flash. The internet let out a combined gasp. The world had been buzzing with rumors about their romance for months. Swift is known for being very private about her love life, so she had kept everything a secret. They were sure of each other, though, and this band, with its sparkling constellation of their love story, was so clear that it could be heard over the loudest stadium crowd. Fans swarmed social media and broke down the bracelets every part. Hashtag Kelsey Swift shot to the top of the list of popular issues. Usually, sports commentators talk about touchdowns and interceptions, but all of a sudden, they knew a lot about famous relationships. Even Travis Kelsey, who is known for being very calm, couldn't hold back his excitement. He posted a picture of himself holding Taylor's hand with the simple statement, my biggest fan. It was a nice surprise to see the act of kindness. Taylor, the pop star, broke down the invisible wall she'd built around her personal life when she showed how much she loved a football player in public. It made them seem more real, and fans all over the world connected with that sweet fragility. The internet didn't stop there, because it's the internet. Photoshop experts made a lot of memes showing Travis catching toy footballs with his charm bracelet or Taylor airing a Chiefs shirt with lightning bolts all over it. Fans wrote stories about epic halftime proposals and touching celebrations in the locker room. It seemed like everyone in the world loved this unlikely celebrity pair for a short time. And Taylor Swift, who is always surprising people, had once again shown that she was the best at the internet game. The era of Kelsey Swift had started, and everyone was looking forward to seeing what touchdown dance they'd do next. On Tuesday night, the internet almost caught fire when pop star Taylor Swift did something that no one saw coming. When Swift was at a Kansas City Chiefs game, she was in a VIP box wearing a special Chiefs jersey with Kelsey 87 on the back of it. The internet went crazy over more than just her clothes. The Chiefs scored a touchdown, and Swift jumped to her feet, pumped her fist in the air, and let out a victory yell that could have been made by any veteran fan. The main event, however, was still to come. With a flourish, Swift pulled out a custom-made Chiefs helmet that looked just like Kelsey's and put it on her head with pride. The crowd erupted in cheers, the announcers were speechless for a moment, and social media went into meltdown mode. Within minutes, hashtag SwiftyGhostChiefs was the most popular rising topic in the whole world. Fans made memes with Swift photoshopped onto Kelsey's receiving route, talked about how real the helmet catch, helmet throw, was, and made guesses about the future of this strange A-list pair. Was this a jokey way to show her support for her boyfriend? A move to make money off of the rich world of NFL fans? Or maybe a hint that the two celebrities will work together, a halftime show extravaganza or a music video with Kelsey, anyone? Everything we knew about Travis Kelsey changed overnight. Kelsey was seen as more than just the famous tight end. He was also the man who won Taylor Swift's heart. Talk shows were buzzing, experts were giving their opinions, and paparazzi were swarming outside of the couple's supposed cabin in the woods. There was no doubt about it, Taylor Swift had done it again. With one perfectly timed helmet throw, she not only cemented her place as a pop culture star, but she also changed what it means to be in a power couple. Last night, a picture of pop star Taylor Swift and NFL star Travis Kelsey caused the internet to almost explode. The couple, who are known for keeping their relationship secret, was seen leaving a cozy Italian restaurant in Los Angeles. They have only been dating for a few months. 
people all over the internet went crazy over Swift's outfit, not the dinner date itself. Her perfectly styled hair and elegant look that usually make her stand out on the red carpet were gone. Swift instead wore a baseball cap that was backwards and a shirt with his number 87 written across the back. The Kansas City Chiefs are Kelsey's team. A fellow diner openly took the picture, which showed Kelsey holding the door open for Swift, which made fans go crazy with love. The shirt, though, was what really made the internet go crazy. Hashtag Tay Tay for Kelsey became popular around the world in just a few minutes. Swift fans who had only seen her in sad songs and silly music videos were now seeing a whole new side of the star. Was this a fun way to say you love me? A joke about Kelsey's well-known competitive nature? Claims spread like Swift could not write a hit song fast enough. Of course, the reporters had a great time. News stories screamed, Taylor Swift goes all out for Travis Kelsey. The entertainment experts couldn't stop talking about the picture, breaking it down frame by frame. Was that a smiley face peeking out from behind the hat? Was Kelsey's grip on her hand a bit too tight? The rumors gave gossip blogs a lot to write about. But even with all the chaos, fans seemed to care most about one thing. Swift, who is known for carefully managing her image, didn't care about what other people thought about Kelsey. This wasn't a planned pose or a fake moment for the cameras. This was Taylor as she really was, in love and wanting everyone to know it. A lot of fans said that the action was a great metaphor for the rumored friendship between them. Kelsey, the flashy tight end who loves celebrating touchdowns, and Swift, the queen of catchy songs and stadiums full of people. Even though they didn't seem to go together, the internet became very interested in this couple. Whether this is a real relationship or a clever marketing stunt, one thing is for sure, Taylor Swift has done it again. She took over the internet not with a song about sadness but with a baseball cap and a love story that everyone can't wait to see. It was fire on the web. Of course, not really, because that would be bad for all servers. In a figurative sense, though, the fires roared with a fury not seen since the 2011 Great Cat Filter. And the speeding agent? Taylor Swift, a country music star who became a pop megastar, and Travis Kelsey, her NFL boyfriend. It all began with a tweet. Just a simple picture. Travis stood there with a bouquet of sunflowers that was higher than him. His famous smile was crinkling his eyes. But the comment set off the internet. It said, my forever muse, and then it showed a single sunflower emoji. The internet, always eager to solve mysteries, swarmed right away. Travis didn't use the word muse very often. He did praise his coaches and friends, but muse? That word was only used by artists to describe ideas. Then it hit them. Hi, Taylor Swift. People had been talking about a possible relationship between the two for months. There were only shaky pictures of them leaving restaurants and rumors of dinner plans that couldn't be proven. But this tweet? This proof was so cocky that it had to be real. Swift's very loyal fans, who are called Swifties, went into overdrive. Overnight, hashtag Swiftles became popular all over the world. On social media, fans had a lot of ideas about a music video where Kelsey would play her lead role. Photoshop experts made funny pictures of Travis, who was oiled up and without a shirt on, catching a football in the air while wearing a fancy cowboy hat. The news wasn't much quieter either. A lot of talk shows were full of rumors. Analysts in sports, who usually talk about scores and interceptions, were suddenly breaking down how Kelsey's tweet made people feel. Was this a trick to get attention? A real statement of love? The whole world held its breath, ready for what to happen next. Next day, at a swift performance that was full to the brim, she did that move. As the first notes of her new hit filled the stadium, people were already getting excited. Then there was a surprise. A movie started to play on the huge screens behind the stage. A hauntingly beautiful piano tune played in the background as a montage of Travis Kelsey's best catches. Each touchdown was like a brushstroke that painted a picture of athletic ease. The crowd yelled, sounding both confused and excited. After that, the show was over. The light quickly moved to the middle of the stage. Travis Kelsey was there, bathed in white light. He wasn't dressed like a football player.